Humanoid Nation. So today's video I'm going to be reacting to is by Silver Lloyd CLE. This guy is part of the Google Reactors community, which I'm part of, and also part of the Reactors League too, but they're two separate things. Because, yeah, this, this guy is part of the group of the Google Reactors thing. Yeah, so... His video is sorry, goddamn, I can't speak today. Today's video is his video is called hashtag Ask Silver Q and A number two to two K milestone. So, oh yeah, congratulations on two K though. Even though that was a while back, what do you have now? Oh, you're in the three K now. Well, you're in three K now, so that's a good thing. So let's full screen this and let's do this shit. Hey, what's up, everyone? This is Silver Rep Boy CLE. How are you guys doing here today? That's right. The Silver Rep Boy coming at you live, looking fresh in the flesh on the next stream on stream. And welcome to Twitter Q and A number two. Now, the topic for this Twitter Q and A was the 2K milestone. It doesn't necessarily have to, your questions doesn't necessarily have to be something to pertaining to the milestone that I reached recently, which was just 2,000 subscribers. I reached the milestone like a few weeks ago. I would say, yeah, I think that's right. And a lot of you guys, now a few of you guys have been submitting me your questions and I even asked other people on Twitter would they like to join my Twitter Q&A and they said it did but unfortunately they haven't but there's always a next time so that's okay thank you for trying guys for those who some Although I haven't watched Q &A, many of his videos could mention do so He talks a lot So um I mean without further ado we'll talk about He talks way too fast and Sometimes I don't understand what he's saying Okay so the first question comes from one of my favorite YouTubers who recently reached over 20k subscribers on his YouTube channel based on this awesome YouTube content, and that is Last Living Human, and he also won a shout out competition. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Phone ringing, but. <clears throat> happens to me all the time. Um, my phone rings all the time. He recently reached 20k subscribers on his YouTube channel, and I always won a shout out competition from yesterday, so without further ado, I'm gonna like to. Uh, Congratulate Last Living Human once again for reaching such a huge milestone. I really wish I was on your your level of subscriber count, but anyway, I'll get there in the future, like you said. Okay, so his question was, what do you use to edit videos? And I would say that's a very great question, Last Living Human. I, well, try to use the most legitimate one that I'll get to in just a minute. But the first one I used, ever since I had this laptop, I used the basic Windows 8 version of Windows Movie Maker. And of course, uh, the Windows Movie were Maker. a little okay, I would say. I but used to have that a lot right. before. But uh, there are a lot of stuff that no I want to do. No longer. Like how most professional YouTubers do when it comes to doing voiceovers or scenes while they're doing the narrations and whatnot. So there's a lot of practice. There are a lot of practice you have to perform when it comes to doing stuff like this for those who use Windows Movie Maker. But I recommend going for a different video editor because, well, you know, like hiring video editors like Sony Vegas, which I do not have. I tried getting one before, but there's a lot you have to do on when it comes to the installation and stuff like that. So I decided to scratch that off. And now he's right, you know. It came to the point where I decided to use one of my favorite video editors in the whole entire century, and that is called Wondershare. That's the video editor I'm using right now because, as you can see, I use the text effect sparkling effect, the pixie dust effect, and displaying the word Wondershare because I love the software, I love the text fonts, I love a lot of stuff they have on the video editor because man, there's a lot you can actually do with the thing because when I first used Wondershare, I thought it was kind of perplexing and of course intense based on its features, but I need, after getting I need to do that. Wondershare though, it's actually pretty legitimate for most people. I need to get Wondershare. For those who want to do voiceovers and whatnot. Uh, don't wait for me here though. Crazy effects. Don't understand any of it, because I tried it like twice. Not have. I couldn't I'm understand any of it, so I never tried version, it again. But you know what though? I actually love Wondershare. Wondershare should be installed on Wondershare or Sony Vegas. But I guess oh, don't make a for people that is new or old. Know what to do. Well, both Sony Vegas and Wondershare are both the same thing, but when it comes to doing tons of more things, I'm thinking that Sony Vegas has more compared to Wondershare, but Wondershare is very awesome. I love Wondershare. I love its color whenever you open it, and of course, go to the main interface when it comes to editing videos and whatnot. You know, like add clips and of course, add sound effects. And another crazy thing about it is that you can actually change your voice. Let's say that you record a voice, and you know who you're you trying to sound like alien. You have to have, like, you remind me of a skinnier version of a skinnier version of a Andre from Black Nerd Comedy. But anyway, Wondershare is one of my favorite video editors. 
Thank you, Last Living Human, for joining me on the Twitter Q and A, and thank you for congratulating me on my 2K milestone. You really are awesome. And when it comes to collaboration, hook me up, man. <laughs> okay, and the last question comes from Jeff, and he asks me, "Why did you start YouTube?" And I love all your videos. First and foremost, Jeff, thank my you name for is Jeff. Your question. And regarding why I started YouTube, it started in 2010. And well, usually I would go to YouTube all the time. To to uh, watch tons of videos like gaming videos, red rock videos, etc, etc, etc. And of course, my big sister taught me into um, making a YouTube profile. And I got my own YouTube profile and of course, I started uploading some old school videos. Not like, well, some of them were actually old school. I'm talking about like the videos that I record from different softwares like say for instance that i recorded some gameplay on my super nes emulator i use that to record f-zero gameplays and of course other gameplay into the emulator as well and when it comes to making music videos i use um pretty loop studio software that she introduced me to and that is pretty loop studio so i got a lot better using pretty loop studio because a lot of you guys have been listening to my remixes and of course you guys have been very thrilled and I've been getting tons of awesome receptions from many people on YouTube pertaining to my music that I make for them to listen to. And of course, I uh, use Windows Movie Maker to make the video and of course, uh, upload it to YouTube. I have been very interested in I know you can still have Windows Movie Maker on Windows 8 or... Tons of receptions and whatnot. I started vlogging since um, either 2012 or 2013. I don't remember what year I... Uh, started vlogging. I, the first vlog I did was when I talked about Blaze Blue Continuum Shift Extend, the PC game that's coming out, that came out. And that was when Christmas almost came. And when I got my camcorder for the first time, that's when I did my third vlog, talking about Nintendo Wi-Fi and stuff. And of course, I got somewhat comfortable in a bit. Um, I don't know what other word I'm going to say to them. But anyway, i gotten a lot more comfortable doing some vlog for you guys. And of course, you guys enjoy them to the fullest. Even though there's no receptions, like no views, no likes, and of course, no comments and whatnot. But <laughs> Sorry, guys. I still keep going to the fullest. I'm going to keep going no matter what. And you guys know how I roll when it comes to YouTube. And I think you do so you, man. About YouTube, you do like you. How people earn tons of YouTube revenue and of course earn YouTube accolades like the silver play button, the golden play button, and of course the crown favorite, the diamond play button. Oh, Speaking of which, Markiplier earned it and he, he's freaking awesome. Markiplier is freaking awesome. And most YouTube channels Mark are Mark Mark awesome. motivation and inspiration to do. I don't know why people say I look like him. I don't look like Markiplier right now. You know, like why do people say I look like Markiplier? Laying out different effects and whatnot, and of course, doing After Effects. Speaking of After Effects, I'm thinking about doing some in the future. I don't know when, but hopefully there will come a time when I get back to doing some After Effects videos. You know, like skits and whatnot. But hopefully, they'll come in the future. But regardless, after hearing so much about that, that's when I started to find tons of software and of course getting tons of these equipments like the mouse, like the mouse, and of course my I have that mouse. HD 1080 camera no, that wait. I got from Best Buy. No, I don't. The Never mind. One compared to the one I have down there, I'm not looking to get it. But anyway, I even have my uh, gaming controller and of course gaming keyboard. A lot of things pertain to gaming and of course doing tons of YouTube videos on my laptop. Like how most people do. Now, you might ask me what I go for, like a Blue Wing microphone. You know, like a professional studio microphone. And my answer would be, I probably wouldn't because, well, one thing for certain, it's all in the headset because you have the headsets plus the professional microphone that people use when it comes to their videos, like gaming and live streaming and whatnot. You have the audio clearance because it has a USB compatible. These headsets are very awesome. The Logitech. Being a headphone headset that I got from Best Buy. This is an amazing these are the amazing because for those that have noticed recently, I got a spare one because I if I ever do it support when I do it because it's give me square barely ever a new pair because the one I had was kind of messed up. Needless to say, but 
Yeah, these headsets are very, these surround headsets are very high quality headsets because they're surround sounds. You can, it's like you're actually, let's say that you watch a video, a concert video, it's like you're actually inside the video watching this person do activities to amuse the audience. And these headsets, compared to speakers, are freaking, freaking awesome because the audio, the audio quality I have compared to my headsets on my laptop. Uh, the audio quality on my laptop is suckish. It's real tech, but it's kind of chugging. Like most laptops, but not the uh, other laptop that I have that still works. It's AC only laptop, needs to say. But anyway, I love these headsets. I wouldn't want to go for a microphone because they're very expensive. Not, not that they're, they're oh, expensive yeah. because, well, I'm looking them up. this headset Microphones are expensive. Holy shit. has the quality of the microphone there is. Like, you can actually hear the microphone feature on this microphone stick on my headset, and it records very legitimately well, and I love this headset. That's why I decided not to go for a microphone, because I'm thinking this might be enough for me. Now, regarding... Yeah, um, my headphones, I think, they're pretty much enough channel, for me with however, microphones. My YouTube channel used to be I don't called know why 4, 6, 4, 9, microphone. 6. But after getting back to doing tons of more videos for you guys, I decided to change my YouTube name. And I know when it comes to changing your YouTube name, you might not manage to get a verification badge to tell people that you're, you've been verified and that you're the real channel that was there prior to when fake channels come. Though I'm not, I don't think there will be any fake channel pertaining to me in the future. Hopefully there won't be any. But uh, if there is Reploids, hopefully you guys will stick to me because you already know how many subscribers I got. You already know how many views I got. You already know how, many, how much popularity I've gained ever since I've been on this channel. Six years ago, and six yeah, years I just ago, freaking love holy you guys crap! Full. I love that you guys will stick to me, and of course, be there for me when it comes to the videos and course, updates and whatnot. Whatever happens, same here, 2012 and around that like time. Like I said, I'm a very generous YouTuber, and I never give my give up my word pertaining to that. And you already know how long I've been tied to this for a long, long time, and I'm never stopping. So yeah, I would think that concludes the Twitter Q and A for it now. This is a this was supposed to be a 2K milestone special. After I got done with my 2K milestone, I decided to do the Twitter Q and A. But I know for some reason I might not get a lot of people. But hopefully on the next Twitter Q and A, I'll get tons more people who join my Twitter Q and A, and I might provide a better topic for you guys so that you can submit me your questions and whatnot. It might be like music or whatever. Logging, I might. I'll think of something on the next 20 Q&A. So, for now, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this to the fullest. And thank those who submitted me your questions for this 20 Q&A. And thank those who decided to join a Q&A but couldn't manage to do so. I really appreciate you guys for trying to uh, get a chance to come to my Q&A video. So, hopefully in the next 20 Q&A, I'll get tons more people to submit, their, submit me their Twitter questions. Like how most people do on YouTube. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this to the full. It was and enjoyable. Check out other videos. It other really content. was. I mean, to channel. Don't forget to subscribe for more. Don't forget to follow my Google Plus and Twitter in the description. Don't forget to join my channel in the description. Don't forget to share because care, like, comment, favorite, like this video, the thumbs up button because it keeps me going and motivated to do more because I love YouTube and you reply to the fullest as well. More videos to come soon. This is a rep plus to I love rep plus to the fullest. I will see you guys in the next video. That ending though was pretty cool. How he like waved away, very waved away. Uh, Waverly, Waverly Line. That's what I'm saying. I think I don't know anymore. But anyways, I I don't I haven't watched much of his videos, but I know who he is. He's part of, like I said the Google Reactors community that we do. I need to check out more of his videos. But anyway, congratulations on your 2K milestone. Even though that was a really a while back, and it takes me a while to get to requests. So y'all know me. <laughs> But uh, anyways, you guys, your 3K now. I don't know if you've done a 3K milestone video. I gotta check that out. But again, congratulations on your 2K, 1K, 3K. Let's do that again. Congratulations on 1K, 2K, 3K, and you can do it. You can still do it, 4K and beyond. But yeah, that's it for now, Humanoid Nation. Humanoid freak out. Bye. Los chilenos no multiplicamos, hay un problema, lo solucionamos, por todo el mundo los chilenos andamos, de bonichoro ahí no paramos, tecnología muy avanzada.